Cocks wake the early morn with many a crow. Loud ticking village clock has counted four. The labouring rustic hears his restless foe, And weary bones and pains complaining sore, Hobbles to fetch his horses from the moor. Some busy gin to team the loaded corn, Which night thronged round the barn's becrowded door. Such plenteous scenes the farmer's yards adorn, Such busy, bustling toils now mark the harvest morn. The bird-boy's peeling horn is loudly blowed, The wagons jostle in with rattling sound, And hogs and geese now throng the dusty road, Grunting and gabbling in contention round The barley ears that litter on the ground. What printing traces mark the wagon's way, What busy bustling wakens echo round, How drives the sun's warm beams the mist away, How labour sweats and toils and dreads the sultry day. His scythe the mower o'er his shoulder leans, And wetting jars with sharp and tinkling sound, Then sweeps again mong corn and crackling beans, and swathe by swathe flops lengthening o'er the ground, While neath some friendly heap snug sheltered round From spoiling sun lies hid their heart's delight, And hearty soaks oft hand the bottle round, Their toils pursuing with redoubled might, Refreshment's cordial hail. Great praise to him be due that brought thy birth to light. Upon the wagon now with eager bound The lusty picker whirls the rustling sheaves, Or ponderous resting creaking fork aground, Boastful at once while shocks of barley heaves, The loading boy revengeful inly grieves To find his unmatched strength and power decay, Tormenting horns his garments interweaves, Smarting and sweating neath the sultry day, With muttering curses stung, he mauls the heaps away. A motley group the clearing field surrounds, Sons of humanity, or ne'er deny The humbler gleaner entrance in your grounds. Winter's sad cold and poverty is nigh, O oh, grudge not providence her scant supply, You'll never miss it from your ample store, who gives denial, hardened, hungry hound, May never blessings crowd his hated door, But he shall never lack that giveth to the poor. Ah, lovely Emma, mingling with the rest, Thy beauties blooming in low life unseen, Thy rosy cheeks, thy sweetly swelling breast, But ill it suits thee in the stubs to glean. O oh, poverty, how basely you demean, the imprisoned worth your rigid fates confine. Not fancied charms of an Arcadian queen So sweet as Emma's real beauties shine. Had fortune blessed, sweet girl, This lot had ne'er been thine. The sun's increasing heat now mounted high, Refreshment must recruit exhausted power. The wagon stops the busy tools thrown by, and neath a shocks enjoyed the beavering hour. The bashful maid, sweet health's engaging flower lingering behind, O'er rake still blushing bends, and when to take the horn Fond swains implore, with feigned excuses its dislike pretends. So pass the beavering hours, so harvest morning ends. O rural life, what charms thy meanness hide, What sweet descriptions bards disdain to sing, What loves, what graces on thy plains abide. O could I soar me on the muse's wing, What riffled charms should my researches bring. Pleased would I wonder where these charms reside, Of rural sports and beauties would I sing, Those beauties' wealth which you but vain deride, Beauties of richest bloom, superior to your pride. 